Hello everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips. In this video here, I'm going to be talking about how to set up the Mano Quarry desktop on Ubuntu. So, in this, in this video in particular, there's a lot of stuff going on. We have to do a lot of different things, so you're going to need your terminal open and you're going to need to have my article open alongside you because there's a lot of commands going on here. So let's start off. We need to make a backup of the sources list. So let me copy this command here. Now this will make a complete backup of the Ubuntu sources. After that, we can go and uh, gain a root shell on Ubuntu. And then we can use these echo commands. Now these echo commands are gonna allow us to easily edit the source file and uh, allow us to add the PPA because the Manoquari desktop is not available on Ubuntu 18.04. And by the way, if you plan on testing out this desktop environment, you're gonna I'm gonna recommend 18.04. But uh, we're doing a little bit of a tweak here by adding the Ubuntu 16.04 repositories, and this can actually be done on most modern Linux distributions, uh, Ubuntu distributions. But you need to have the Ubuntu archive. So let's recover the apt key. And this will give us the key server to the Manoquari 16.04 software repository. And then we can, as I was saying, we can add the rest of the stuff and add the Ubuntu package archive. And this will give us all the dependencies that the Manoquari desktop needs that 16.04, that 18.04 that we're using cannot deliver or, you know, 18.10 or whatever can't. So let's just lots of echo commands, you guys. <laughs> and uh, let's add this last one here. And this one will for sure give us 1604's package archives. As you can see, it's a multiverse restricted and universe. After that, we need to run the apt update command. Now, if you look here, you'll see Bionic, but you'll also see Xenial, 1604 Xenial and that means that all these repositories are working. And then we can just install the Manoquari desktop. And uh, updates take a bit, but uh, you know, the cool thing about Ubuntu is that you can mix up sources um, to meet package repository requirements. So I added the 16.04 software repository and this is allowing me to try this desktop environment and use it. So just gotta wait for the updates to finish and uh, then I can install everything that I need. Just taking an inordinate amount of time though for some reason. But yeah, the developer behind this has not updated it to 18.04 so that's why I did this. Anyway, do apt install manoquari you can also install Tebu flat icon theme and Bromo theme. And this is all coming from our 16.04 repos and the uh, you know the the PPA that we added. Just if you look here, you can see the PPA is right there. All right, so now that everything is installed, we can go ahead and close out, close the terminal, and log out of the system. And uh, now we're back at the login screen. And go through, select Manoquari, Man what a Manowar, whatever I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> Enter your password, and uh, there's the desktop. I like it. It definitely needs work, but it's promising and uh, it's usable. You can do a lot of different stuff. It's got a lot of cool features. 
So that is how you get the Manowari desktop environment working on Ubuntu. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and as always, I will see you in the next one.